Yo, what's going on? It's your boy DJ32, and I'm back with another rap conspiracy. Many believe that the deaths of Tupac and Biggie are linked and that Biggie's murder was a retaliation from the Tupac murder due to the whole East Coast, West Coast beef. But there's another theory as well. Detective Russell Poole was the main investigator attempting to solve the murder of Biggie. And after one year of investigation, he pushed out a theory that Suge Knight along with the LAPD was behind everything. He also said that Suge Knight was not only responsible for Biggie's murder, but Tupac's as well. Listen to what Poole says in the footage from the 2002 documentary, Biggie and Tupac. And do you think that there was a connection between the Tupac Shakur killing and the Biggie Smalls killing? Well, that's uh, basically what it appears to be, uh, a retaliation, okay? And I think Suge Knight wanted it to, uh, to look that way, okay? But... Uh, you know, had we been able to aggressively investigate and uh, had the heart to uh, connect the two and, uh, and do a thorough investigation, I think we probably would have found out more information. And why didn't you? Well, you know, there's a lot of factors, but uh, I think the fact that law enforcement officers were working for death row and that was a scandal in itself okay so Poole believes suge knight set up the shooting of tupac to look like gang violence in order to not have to pay millions in royalties to the rapper then with the help of the lapd he also set up biggie shooting to appear like a retaliation against tupac's murder it was no secret that death row records uh, was involved in drug trafficking between 30 and 40 police officers some of whom are seen here worked off duty for death row Suge Knight had a lot of power, even within the DA's office. Now back in 2005, a key witness in the civil suit against the LAPD, filed by the family of Biggie, stated that the LAPD was involved in the shooting. Later in 2007, that witness, Wayman Anderson, recanted his testimony, causing the case against the LAPD to fall apart. About the same time that the civil suit was dismissed, Poole left the LAPD after he had a number of issues with handling of homicides by the police force, but the story gets a little bit stranger. Flash forward to 2015. On August 19th, Poole was meeting with the LA County Sheriff's Department about a cold case, but then collapsed, reportedly suffering from a heart attack. He was rushed to the hospital where he died on site. What exactly was the cold case that he was presenting to the Sheriff's Office? Was it about Biggie? Did he have any new evidence to bring to light? Let us know what you think and make sure y'all comment below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. I'm DJ32 for Power 106, and this has been another Rap Conspiracy. Special thanks to Robert Wayne Footwear and Doc Martin.